Well, one family is calling on the community to keep their sister's killer behind bars. This case goes back nearly 40 years in Riverside. A man shooting and killing Mary Alice Mitchell in 1985 while she was working as a clerk at a convenience store. Two News reporter Leah Seabrook spoke to the family ahead of a parole hearing for Mitchell's convicted killer in an interview you'll see only on two. Here almost 40 years ago, Mary Alice Mitchell died after being shot several times during a convenience store robbery during a winter blizzard. Somebody murder somebody, they need to stay in prison. James Mitchell says the night of his sister's murder still haunts him. 27 year old Mary Alice Mitchell was gunned down during a robbery at the convenience store where she worked. According to family, Mary was not supposed to be working that night. She was filling in for a co-worker who couldn't make it when prosecutors say Dennis Roscoe Jones unloaded sentenced to 20 years to life in prison for the murder. He has been denied parole several times, but will be eligible again this August. Mitchell's family says Jones should never be let out, and they want other people to join their cause. The Mitchell family is asking for the community to support them by writing letters to have Jones's parole denied. You can send letters to this address. Montgomery County Prosecutor Matt Heck personally handled this case in 1985. Today, in a statement to Two News, the prosecutor says in part, quote, I am absolutely against parole for Dennis Roscoe Jones. This defendant callously murdered Miss Mitchell and showed her no mercy. This defendant deserves to spend the rest of his life in prison. Her sister says even through the pain, they are fighting to keep their sister's memory alive. And I just tell her I love her, but I have to do it through the dirt. I can't see my sister. I can't touch her. I can't kiss her. And it hurts. Letters of support to deny Jones's parole must be received by August 16th to be considered. In Riverside, Aaliyah Seabrooks, 2 News.